Hello friends and my dear students and uh, we already discussed uh, outer uh, join left and this time I'm going to discuss outer join right. So uh, in left outer join what we have seen that uh, the left there, there were two tables left table and the right table and we when we applied uh, left outer join then we have seen that uh, all the records which were common in two tables were selected and in addition the left over left over records or rows of the first table or the left table had also been selected so over here in this case when we are going to apply right outer join we'll see all the common or common rows or the rows which are matching will be selected and the left over records or rows of the right table or the second table will be selected in this for example as we have a table like this this was the table and we had the second table which is labs in this when we applied left outer join then we have seen that only l1 l2 l3 were matching and l4 was the left over record so in the result we have seen that uh, aniket amrit and swasni with the computer lab economics and face lab were selected were in the relation and the niche 1005 and Rajneesh were also in the table but uh, uh, lab name and blocks these were set to null but here what will happen if we apply Venn diagram then we'll see the common elements or common rows like L1, L2, L3 will be selected and left over l6 will also be selected in the relation in the resultant relation so l4 which is in the table left will not be there in the result so see here so the there are two tables and how to apply sql statement uh, using right join so this is the Venn diagram and what should be the statement this we are going to see here select student ID student name lab name block from student and write auto join labs on student dot lab is equal to labs dot lab so when we apply this command the result which we expect will be this this time left and block are filled but the left table is not having the elements or the values corresponding to l6 and that is why sid and s name are null so let's move to our mysql so we are in mysql here so these are two tables this one table and this is the labs table and we are going to display select sid comma s name comma lab name comma block from student 
and write outer time lapse on student dawn dot lab is equal to labs dot lab so here you see this is the result first two columns are left null because there is no element corresponding to l6 which is in lab table so this is your right turn. so hope you understood and if you understood then kindly share it with your friends and uh, if you have not subscribed my channel kindly subscribe it so that you get your uh, notifications right away as soon as any video is new video is uploaded thank you and